Hey guys, how the frig's it going today? You know what one of the problems I have with freaking winter is? Even though it's not winter, it's currently like plus 10 outside on November, yeah, Thursday, November 5th. It gets dark by the time I get off work, which means I was actually thinking, you know, I was thinking, you know what would be kind of fun is if I got off work and we went for a hike up the hill over there. Problem is, as five o'clock hits, there's no sunlight out. It's dark. Not about to go trudging through the woods in the dark. That's what happened to Little Red Riding Hood, and we all know how that story turned out. Anyway, guys, what I was thinking about doing tonight is, I was thinking, well, as you can tell, oh, dude, super fluffy here. It's super fluffy. Okay, he's a furball. I called the pet groomer. I wanted to see how much it would cost to get Oreo groomed. Due to COVID restrictions, they're only seeing so many dogs a day, so I won't be able to get him groomed anytime, any, anytime in the near future. Now here's the thing, not only is Oreo fluffy as frig, he also smells like the business end of a skunk. I think we're gonna try something here. We're gonna try and cut him. Now my friend gave me this. It's a, a grooming kit for doggies, and I tried it last time and it didn't have much success, but I'm willing to give her a rip again because we gotta have some success. We gotta get this dog's fur under control. That and I wanna bathe him because like I said, he smells like the business end of a skunk it ain't doing it for me, bud. It ain't doing it for me. So, I'm gonna go ahead and plug in this razor. So this one here is, you can, uh, sorry, I got you guys on manual focus. I'm filming with the DSLR in case you're wondering. I might be able to grab some fur in like that and chop it. But this, this one here works pretty good, I am hoping. Let's get you guys set up and see if we can cut some dog fur. Let's go. Sit there. Should we take off your collar first? Stand up. Alright, let me have like grooming things on here. Stop moving your head. Stop it! Friggin' licking me. Would you stop that? Hey! Come on, stupid. Work with me. Freaking cat. She's taking shots at me from under the bathroom door. Come on, Oreo. Let me get rough with you. I don't want to give you a haircut that looks like I put a bowl on your head. Eat, baby. You have so much matted fur. <sighs> so much matted fur on the puppy wuppy. Some people are at home giving their children haircuts like this, and this with your kids, you can sit them in a chair. I'm trying to cut your fucking fur. Next, I gotta watch around his ears because I can't tell his ears. He's got this huge quet here. Hi, lay down. He's got this like huge mound. It's from his old collar. I showed you guys that I got him a new collar. I think I did. Almost see your ears again. Oh my god! Sitting down like that hurts my legs. It'd be so much nicer if I had like a table or something to sit them on. Sorry. You okay? You went a little bit too deep. <laughs> Oops. Okay, calm down. You're already getting a bucket head haircut here. What brings your ear? There it is. Back. Oh, why do you gotta be such a little dog? You can be just a little bit bigger. Just a little bit bigger. Stop moving around. I'm gonna shave off your friggin' whiskers, bud. Oh, man. Get over here. Set your shitter. Where's the 
the battery on this thing was a little better. Oh man, I wonder if there's extra batteries in the back of this. Problem with the cabled one is find the dog's always in the way <laughs> and he keeps getting the cable on him. Okay, what's your ear and what's the mat? That's the mat right there, right? That's your ear, yes. Relax. You have a huge mat. Just let me get this off. It's so much easier if I had another pair of hands here. See, I think the groomers have something that they tie him up to. I really wish he would stay still. I know this is no fun, Oreo, but if your fur didn't grow, we wouldn't have this problem. Of course, that's partly my fault because I buy you good dog food, but... Oh my god, I mangled you. You look stupid. <laughs> Sorry for beating you with the cable. I don't mean to. You got an itch? Get it? Get over here! <sighs> it's like I'm trying to make you look stupid, but... It's also really hard not to make you look stupid because I can look at your face. Dude, you have the breath of a thousand assholes. Holy crapping. Man, after this, you're getting a fucking bath. Yeah, you're gonna go in the shower. Are you just gonna bite me? You're gonna bite me? You don't bite me. You don't do that guy. I know, this isn't the funnest thing to be doing on a Thursday night, but like, dude, it's COVID time. Nobody's around to shave you. So I gotta step up and do it. But I need you to sit. Yeah, do that. Shake it off. Just trying to get your fur as short as possible. Wait, I gotta do your butt next. That's gonna be fun. I wonder what kind of Klingons are gonna find down there. Eh? What kind of dirt mud nuggets are we gonna find in your bum? Got this like one tuft of fur. Oh my god, this friggin' wire is annoying. And guys, I actually did buy a cordless uh, a cordless cutter, but it doesn't work for his fur, so I had to improvise. My friend gave me this one here that she had for her dog, or for one of her old dogs. And it works on him, it's just a pain in the ass, because he moves around too much. <laughs> you puppy. Okay, turn around. Turn around and up. I need you to work with me. This is where I could use an extra set of hands. Somebody to hold his tail up while I shave his ass. Or you'll work with me. Work with me. Hey, stand up. Stand up. Keep your... You know how hard this is to do? You're a pain in my arse, you know that, right? You're a pain in my arse. More like a pain in my lower back. But... Get over here! No more. I'm not done with you. Oh man, my back. Come here! Get over here! Come on! The joys of shaving a Pomeranian. I wonder why the groomers charge me $100 for this. They'll probably charge me 25 bucks an hour. Holy shit. Well, there we go. That's a mess. Let's get him out of here before he freaking spreads it everywhere. But anyway guys, I gave him a bath and he would just sit. 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 Sit right there. Sit. My goodness. I gave him a bath. The problem is, is uh, he's super wet and I don't have a hair blower. I don't know where the hell I put it, so now we got this and all that wet. He's going to make a lot more of as the night goes on. 
not much I can do about it. I'm just gonna have to uh, clean my floor later on once he finally dries out. But we took a lot of fur off of him. I already cleaned up the bathroom floor. I uh, basically used the shop vac because yeah, to pick up all the big clumpies, and then I used the the bissel with the carpet beater to basically pick up all the dander and all the sand and dirt and debris that came off of them during the cleaning. It's hard to tell exactly how much was taken off of them right now because he's a wet scraggly looking mud. But I assure you, a lot of fur came off the dog. I should have did a weigh in before and after with him, eh? That's what I should be doing, weighing him in and being like, well, before I shaved him, he was like nine pounds, and now that I shaved him, he's five pounds. No, there's no way I took three pounds of fluff off of him. Maybe tops a couple ounces, but maybe a pound. I don't know, those wads that were behind his ears are pretty menacing, and they're gone now, but all I know is I'm getting a soaker walking on this floor right now. It's friggin' sweet. And I really, 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 really friggin' wish I had my hair blower so I could blow dry his hair, but I don't know where it is. I was looking for it the other day when I was painting the bait. Couldn't find it then and I forgot about it and then when I started washing them I went, oh crap, where the hell's my hair blower? I still haven't found that. So, some bitch pile of monkey nuts, it is what it is. Any people on that note, I'm gonna, this is just a short video, I know, you're probably expecting some epic, super long vlog, but I think I'm just gonna start doing shorter videos over the winter, just, you know, something to, something to fire up on the channel about things that I'm doing, whether it be a recipe or shaving the dog or scolding the cat, whatever the case may be, and uh, go from there. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you did, click the like button. Any questions, comments, concerns, down below they go. And until next time, guys, stay safe and live to win. Never give in. Sit, stupid, sit. Good dog.